Hello everyone and welcome to episode 42 of our Road to Cricket Glory career mode everyone with New Zealand in Cricket Captain 2020 where today this is the lineup that we've pulled together for the first one day international of three against Sri Lanka. We are playing at Sky Stadium in Wellington. Should be an interesting match. We've actually decided to rest Ross Taylor at least for now. The reality is that right now in the international calendar it is pretty much as you can see it's sort of a trial. There's no World Cup for another two years yet. Whether we win or lose this series against Sri Lanka, I mean, I guess our ranking gets impacted, but I, w I care about winning the World Cup more than what ranking I am in the World Cup. As long as I make the World Cup, it doesn't really matter. So with that in mind, I have decided to bring in Will Young for his one day international uh, debut. I will actually put him at number five because I feel like I should back him a bit. Tom Latham is back and he's at number six. We've got Conway at number four. Again, it's all about trying to gain experience right now. We're currently missing an ODI opener. So it's going to be, I've passed the baton to George Worker and said, look, are you going to be there in two years? Matt Henry is back as well in place of Lockie Ferguson. And I have sent a few players to domestic cricket. I will point that out. This is the team that we are going with. It should be an interesting one. Here we go. Okay, they've got Nisanka and Vermukthi on debut. I apologize if I butchered that. They've got Kushal Mendes, and I think that's Kamindu. How many all-rounders do they have? Six all-rounders. Have they played much this year? Hasaranga averages 50. Kushal Mendes, 55. Dan and Jaya De Silva, 40 as well. So they've got some very good players there. Looks like an even contest as well. Three debutants in the mix across the whole game. We've lost the toss and been put into bat. And I will also point out the pitch conditions. We can actually see the bounces average. Let's see what we can put on the board in the first innings. At the Sky Stadium, we are just going to pull back in the first over. We've got Fernando bowling to work out a full toss and he pulls it away and it will be four runs. I will point out that George Worker has scored a ton in between his poor series against Australia. But I mean, again, most people had a struggling time against them anyway. 17 for none, 19 for none. Dab that away nicely, Worker, and it will be four. That's very good stuff. Oh no, he's played all around it just after he hit a boundary. He didn't need to do that. And he's gone for 17 of 25. Another start, but he's gone again. Fernando around the wicket. Gutful drives nicely through the covers. Deep extra cover just twiddles his thumbs on that one. That's three extra cover. And the deep cover can't get around to that one either. That's four more. Gutful. Oh, my. Uh, deep covers just watching it sail past him, basically. That's three boundaries. We are flying out the gates at 5.6. 41 for one. Williamson. He drives in the air. Fine, and it will be four. 48 for one. Around the wicket, Udana. Oh, I actually thought he would have got Williamson there, but it's well whipped away. Good stuff from Kane. That's going to be four. 53 for one after 10. Fernando around the wicket. Nice. That's Kane-esque. That's really good. Off the back foot from Williamson for four. Guttel on a free hit. He whacks it off the back foot for four more. These two are actually pretty good together. They are two of New Zealand's best players. Here we go. We've got Namesh Vamukthi. Averages 27 in the one-day format and is playing his first international game ever. Okay, congratulations to Vamukthi on debut. Concedes his first run. I think that was a wide. And a single. Cut away. Guptal gets it fine and it will be four. Hasaranga. Now, he is obviously very, very good in the T20 format. We must all point that out. His one day internationals, not so much so far. Definitely still see him as a threat. Hasaranga to Guptal. Leg spinner. Oh, nicely driven from Guptal. Straight down the ground. That'll be four. Moves to 35 off 35. He's flying away. Vermukthi to Guptal. Tossed up. Nicely driven off the back foot from Guptal. That will be four. If I am pronouncing it wrong, do let me know in the comments down below as well. Uh, in advance, I apologize if that is wrong. That's a good shot from Guptal through mid-wicket for four. Moves to 43. I tell you what, Guptal has just been unbelievable this year. 116 average. Kane honestly doesn't need to change the tempo. We're going cruising at six and over. Hasselreya to Williamson. Tosses it up. Off the back foot. Through point. That will be four. Very nice. 92 for one. We're starting to get the little feeling that this is a belter. Cut away. Guptal in the air, but it's in the gap. Will be four. Moves to 47, I believe. Guptal. Tossed up. Swept away from Guptal. And that will be four. And that will be a 50 for Guptal. Continues his fine form. His 40th one-day international 50. And his third this year to go with 100. 
Now, I actually apologize about this because I was going to bring it up, but I did indeed forget. This is Trent Bolt's 100th One Day International match as well, so congratulations to Trent Bolt there. 107 for 1. Hasselranger to Williamson. Tossed up. Driven. Pass. I think that's cover point. That will be 4. 111 for 1. A lot of spin in the middle here. Guttel goes leg side, and he, well, it sounded much better than it looked. That will be four. 117 for one. That's straight from Hasselranger, but Williamson just whips it away. Over the top for four. Hasselranger to Williamson. Still only one wicket falling so far. It's in the air. Oh my goodness me, I thought it was going to go all the way. One bounce, four. 125 for one. This is an inc insane partnership. It really is. Cut away from Guttel through point. That will be four. 131 for one. Dabbed away from Williamson. Four more. These two have put on a partnership and a half right now. 23 overs gone. Cruising home. I don't I don't have any other comments to say right now. Tossed up off the back foot from Kane. And that will be a 50 to Williamson there. Yet another one. His 43rd One Day International 50. This year's statistics. Every format. Top notch. Dan and Jaya to Silva. And he bowls pretty well actually. 148 for one. The Mook Thie on debut. And he gets Kane as his first wicket. Oh, no. Kane's played across the line. The partnership's broken. It's just skidded on. And he's gone for 55 or 59 and gives Vermukthi a maiden one-day international wicket. Congratulations to him. And that's a good wicket to pick first up. Devin Conway walks out now with Will Young next in. We've got Gupta well and truly set. Can he stay in is the real question. 155 for two. No. No, he can't. He plays all around it. I kind of, I just had a had an itch coming that maybe he, he was just going to get himself out, and he did. Will Young comes to the crease, and all of a sudden, he's off the mark, and we are in big trouble. So this is Will Young's first ball in one-day internationals. Hasselring it. Look at the field he's got. He's got a short cover, 158 for three, and now we've got to recalibrate the innings equation. Is that out? Oh no, Will Young's gone early on Taboo. Goodness me, he's gone for one. I've given him the chance. He hasn't taken it though. 158 for four, a collapse has definitely happened. But Conway has just slapped that away for six. Teetering at the 30 over mark. I still feel like we've got time to settle in here. I mean, I did up his aggression and now I feel bad about it. That's whipped away nicely though, that will be four through mid-wicket. Hasselrang is last over, so let's just see it out. Let's see it out, 174 for four. Nice from Conway, that's very good. Down the ground, Hasselrang to Conway again though. Whipped away nicely. Down the ground, that will be four more. Dan and Jaya to Silva, to Latham. Nice, nicely done off the back foot from Latham, that will be four. Tossed up again. Down the ground from Latham, that will be four. Fernando return, 15 overs to go, still plenty of time. Fernando to Latham, cut away. Beats mid off for four. Interesting, very good stuff. Nice from Conway. Worked away in the gap, worked away into the leg side nicely for four. That's another good over from De Silva. Conway onto 30. Latham's bold though by Fernando. Gets his middle stump. Nisham to the crease. Now, Nisham did have a very good series against Australia. So, it should be interesting to see how he goes today. 205 for 5, though. Looking dicey. But Conway belts that straight. He grabs a 4. One run to Nisham. Down the ground from Conway. That will be 4. Conway's producing a good innings here. But can he convert? All the way. That's a long way. Out of here. That is brilliant shot from Conway. Can Conway prove himself today to me, more importantly, and more importantly probably to himself, that he can do it at this level? I've been backing him for a while. His average hasn't been great. Has he made a 50 yet? He's never made a 50 in the one-day international format either. This is his chance today. Can he make it? No! No, no! No, that's not what I wanted. He nicks off. Oh, the game is just so cruel. It really is. Eight overs to go, and we are in all sorts of dire trouble. We can't really launch, because if we launch, we'll have a bowler walk out. Satna. Nicely driven off the back foot, though. That'll be four. We're just going to punch it. You done it. Well, Nisham whacks it away. Leg side, it'll be four. 234. Nisham goes again. Harder this time. Hits the same fence. It'll be four more. Yudana, two overs to go. Nisham. Nice off the back foot. That'll be four. 247. Satna. Is that out? I was going to say. Thought it came off his boot or something. 
Wax it. Four. Very good. Three overs to go. All right, Nisham's going to take down Den and Jaya to Silva. I don't know if it's going to work. Well, it does on that ball. Swept away. It beats the player. It'll be four. 250 up. Can we make 300? I mean, that's ambitious, I think. There's three overs to go. That's leg side from Satna. That's four more. Nisham, we're taking it to the limit here. Satna goes for it. It'll be in the gap. It'll be four. 268. Can we make 280? It's plumb in front. He goes for a big heave out. Satna goes. It's a good innings, though. 21 of 28. Good little cameo. All right, Matt Henry. Go, Nisham. Slogs it, and he's gone. Umpire gives him out, but there's no need. The middle stump is gone. Bowlers will walk out here. Oh, Jameson, he's never good in the last over. He's never good. He's nicked off. Jameson. I tell you, there's something about him and last overs. Double wicket maiden to end the innings. Oh, that's just not ideal. Well bowled from De Silva, though. Three for 43. One for 45 from Vermukthi. He bowled very well on Dabu as well. Udana and Fernando, two each. One for Hasaranga. And we'll be bitterly disappointed given the start that we had. Partnership of 125. And then look at that. 47 and 44. Good partnerships, but they just weren't good enough. All right, it's time to bowl. We have Kyle Jameson to bowl to Fernando and Nisanka. Jameson to Fernando. Belted straight. It'll be four. He's off the mark. Now, Nisanka, his first class record is insane. He's off the mark. Fernando goes down the ground against Bolt. That'll be four. Bolt is playing his 100th ODI. Swing and a miss. Well, Bolt, Bolty. Nisanka pulls it away off a length. It'll be four. Oh, it's a beaut. Kyle Jameson to Nisanka. Cut away, nearly all the way. It's really well hit to bring Matt Henry into the attack. He hasn't played much under the career mode so far, and he bowls a very good over first up. Jameson into his fifth. Driven from Fernando, beats the player at short cover. It'll be four, 36 without loss, and they are well and truly, yeah, 41 for none. They're on target. Jimmy Nisham, the change bowler, comes on, and Nisanka just whacks it through extra cover for four. Matt Henry's going to continue. Bowls very well. Jimmy Nisham will get a second over. See how he goes. Off the back foot, though. The answer is not well. That'll be four. Matt Henry into his fourth. To Fernando and bowls him. Gets it to move off the seam. 56. The opening stand. And Fernando departs for 25. Kushal Mendes. He's had a very good year. Let's see how he goes here. Kushal Mendes. Henry to Mendes. Oh, no. Let's see how he bowls today. Let's see. Let's just give him the ball and see what happens. Mitchell Satner. To Kushal Mendes off the back foot. Smashes it for four. Matt Henry into his fifth. To Nisanka. Edged. Oh, he's edged it fine. A deep third for four. Trembot will come back. Why not? To Nisanka. Oh, how is that not out? Oh, it's just going on. I thought it came back. Bolt to Mendes. Whipped away. Fine. Just a bit too straight for four. Satna to Nisanka. He's well and truly set at the moment, Nisanka. And he dabs it away over the man. Not over, it's actually under him. Let's just see what happens. Kane Williamson to Nisanka. Just going to chuck it over to Kane Williamson. Let's see what happens. And he bowls him! What the heck? Would you believe it? Nisanka gone for 43. Beaten by spin. I'm not sure anybody could say that. But Kane Williamson picks it up with one that pretty much goes straight on with the arm. I'm not entirely sure what it means by beaten by spin. They've got Angelo Matthews in. I thought he doesn't play much for Sri Lanka nowadays. But here he is. Angelo Matthews, Kane Williamson. Oh, he's got two and two. Kane Williamson's got two wickets in a row. What is this? You are got to be kidding me. Angelo Matthews, a Sri Lankan legend. And he's gone first. Ball, I cannot believe what I'm seeing. I really cannot. This is incredible. Kane Williamson on a hat trick. He's on a hat trick. Williamson to Mendes. Tossed up. Oh, he drives it away. Come in to Mendes for four. Would you believe it? Kane Williamson, two for four. What the heck? Mitchell Satner, I, I do not want to know what he's feeling right now, but it's not, it's probably not a great feeling. That's four runs by Kusha Mendes. 95 for three, Sri Lanka. That double, double strike from Kane really changed this game as Kusha Mendes hits another boundary. Satner to Mendes. This is an interesting battle here, but Mendes is just dominating it. That's four more. 100 for three. Two wickets in his first over. I mean, I can't not bowl him again. Would you believe Kane Williamson? I should have used him in Australia or something. What the heck? Trent Bolt returns and he bowls well. Kane Williamson's got two for six and two overs. Go, Kane. He's tossed it up. Oh, it's going to be four. It's a good shot from Kamindu Mendes. Bolt into his sixth over to Kushal Mendes. He's the key wicket. 
And that's why he's been gobbled at first slip. It's a big wicket. Kushal Mendes for 29. Batting form shows the form he's in. And he's nicked it straight to slip. Danajaya to Silva walks out. Kane Williamson's got three overs, two for 13. But again, he's got the two wickets in the first over. Not much sense. That's a great shot from Danajaya to Silva, though. That'll be four. I think Kane's spell might be done. Trent Bolt to Kamindu Mendes. That's off the back foot. He's hammered that for four. Oh, that's a beauty. Okay, we'll bowl the fifth. I just, there's something about Kane Williamson's figures that I just can't get rid of. Can't shake it. Okay, maybe I'll shake it now because that's out of here. It's supposed to be a maiden. It's gone for six. Let's bring Jameson back. They need 134 at six and over. We need to be careful here. But realistically, we get into the lower order and I think we'll get the job done. I think one wicket will change this game. Matt Henry. Oh, my. Shot from Commander Mendes through the covers. That's four. Henry. Oh, smash from Kamindu Mendes. Jimmy Nisham has to come on and bolt to Mendes. Cut away. Oh, it's a misfield. That's, Jimmy Nisham will not be happy with that. I mean, it's just unlucky. That don't know what to do. I don't. Think if we can bowl Kane one more. Satna doesn't have to bowl another over. He bowls very well, Kane. He doesn't have to bowl another over, Satna, which is strange to say because he's bowling really well at the moment, but just not today. Is that down leg? Oh, oh, oh it just misses. Just Nisham to Mendes. Instant gone! It's a great take from Latham. Nisham takes the big wicket. Mendes gone for 45. Minod Banuka. Kane into his seventh. I'm just going to do it. It's just not often that Kane's bowling this well. Oh, as soon as I say that, he got thumped. That is out of here. That is on another street. Banuka. Oh, he's got him, is he? He's got him! He's got him! He's six and out! Kane Williamson's got three! You would not read about this in the papers, because it's just never happened, probably, I don't know, ever. Renindu! Wax that straight down the ground, it will be four. Kane, I don't know what to say, I think you're done. They need 86, this game is getting down to the wire, I must add. Matt Henry returns to Hasaranga. He wallops it though! For four. They need sixes per over. We need wickets. And funny enough, Kane's got half of them. So I'm going to keep bowling him. Down the ground, though, from Dan and Jai. It's going to be four. Is this the right decision? Hard to tell because he's a batter who shouldn't normally take wickets. But he could have a fourth. Someone get there. He's got four. Kane Williamson. What is going on? He's got Dan and Jaya De Silva. Vermukthi comes to the crease on Dabu. Goodness me. I cannot believe what I'm seeing. Matt Henry goes to Vermukthi. Nice shot though. Beats square leg. It's his first boundary. Possibly his first runs as well. Down the ground though from Hasarang. It's four more. That's not good. That's not what we want right now. Can Kane get a five? I mean, I just... You wouldn't... You wouldn't believe it. You wouldn't believe it. Because I can't. I can't believe he's taken one. He's taken five against Sri Lanka. That is surely the first five for in my entire career in Cricket Captain, where a batter has taken five wickets. I cannot believe it. Kane five for 46. I don't believe it. I really don't. It's his best bowling ever. He's got a chance for a sixth. Yudana walks out to the crease. He's going to get him stumped. I am bemused. This is not happening. On what planet does this happen? I can't believe it. He's got a sixth. He's got 6 for 46. It's his best figures ever. He's on a hat trick to finish the game. Mitch Satner. Can he get the last wicket? He's back on. And he gets the last wicket. So Kane won't get a 7th. But he gets his first Satner. And he finishes the game. Fernando gone for 1. And New Zealand win by 61 runs. No, 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 no. Kane Williamson. New Zealand's best ever batter. Has just broken a record. For New Zealand's best bowling in an innings. For New Zealand, for the match, New Zealand versus Sri Lanka at Wellington. There's no way I'm reading this right now. That's awesome. How often does that happen? That's never going to happen again. I'm just going to say it. But oh my gosh, how cool is that? Look at that scorecard. Six for 47. There or thereabouts. But he's taken two wickets in a row twice and single-handedly changed the whole game.
He wasn't even supposed to bowl, he's a batter. None for 30 from Jameson, one for 31 from Bolt, one for 46 from Henry. They all bowled pretty well. Henry probably took a little bit of tap at the end. They all bowled really well up front, and I'm very happy with the seam attack that we've got at the moment, especially with Lockie on the bench. Jimmy Neesham, one for 24, taking a wicket, and Mitch Satner taking one at the end there. But Kane was the star of the show, taking his best ever figures in his one-day international career, and in his entire career, he's taken two one-day fifers. He took six wickets at an average of nine. Point three three. He can't do no wrongs at the moment, and we win by 61 runs. We leave the series 1-0. I will say that it was a disappointing result for Will Young. I've given him a couple of debutants this season. He's got 5 naught and 1. I've got to have the faith, because Kome got 45 today. His average goes to 21. Again, it's not great, but I just have the faith that it's going to get better. I do not know what to say. 6 for 47. But we move on to the second one day international three. Against Sri Lanka once again. A day-night clash. You see partnerships of 57, 56, 31, 28. So they were there, but they just couldn't finish it off. If you did enjoy, then please make sure you leave a like, subscribe for more content such as this, join the Discord server, linked down in the description, hit the post notification bell, and until the next video, take care everyone.